Hi, I'm Dave, this is Dave's Weird Project, and I'm back with more Into the Breach. We're working on our four island victory with the Flame Behemoths, and uh, we finished Detritus Island, and I think we'll probably do, let's, let's do the Cold Island next, Pinnacle. Uh, but real quick, before we get started, I just want to mention, I'm probably going to make this the last timeline for Into the Breach for a while. Uh, I feel like I'm, after four islands, win or lose, uh, I've showed you a pretty good range of the game, how, how good it is. And I'd like to move on to something else, but I'd like to get your feedback on uh, what I should play. So if you're interested in any of the following, um, just say so in the comments. FTL, that's also from the makers of this, uh, Subset Games. It's a really cool little um, space adventure. You're on a little ship and flying, trying to get to the, the, the ultimate goal and deliver the secret plans, that kind of deal. There's also Dungeon Top, For the King... Dicey Dungeons, and SteamWorld Quest. These are all things I've picked up recently. I don't know a whole lot about any of them, um, uh, but I'm really interested in trying any of them, so check them out, uh, look them up, see what you think, and let me know what you'd like to see me play. Just uh, drop a line in the comments. Okay, so here we go. We're going to jump into our Pinnacle Robotics. Okay. Here's the AI. I hope you can respect both forms of life on this island. Organic and mechanical. Alright, so we got a nice triple here. Defend the robot factories. It's a good one. Freeze defend both robots. Defend the robots. Lots of defending. Uh, yeah, let's let's go for this one. Um, I think we've seen this one before. If you'll recall, these robot factories, we have to protect them. But they are going to shoot out damaging little robots <laughs> that are going to try to kill us. Or the other buildings. We're also trying to protect this robotics lab to get a power core. Pods coming in. Have to protect that. Okay. So we will most likely want to do a swap with this um, to uh, to get it out of there. It's really the only way to get to the darn thing. Uh, let's see. We might push this to the side. Seems good. Um, push him down so he doesn't hit the building. Yeah, that seems good. Okay, so... Let's do that, and I guess, let's see, I guess we'll go, we'll swap, we have, what, one, one extra range, so we'll swap him here. I really wanted to put him on this, but I couldn't get there, uh, and then, uh-oh, we're gonna have, we're gonna take a hit from this. Well, it's okay, we got plenty of health. On fire. All right, so we're going to take two there, but there is no mech damage uh, restriction, so we should be all right. Oh, they got the regen dude. Now he's awake. He's going to shoot at the cistern. He's a laser, so I think he... Um, yeah, he shoots in a straight line, hits everything. All right, oof, oh, we got two here. Uh, let's see, who's first in the order of these two? He's first. Okay. He's doing that, he's doing that. Da, 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 da. Let's see. Ooh, we could swap him to here. This guy, put him here, and it would take care of this and this. He would... Um, uh, get killed before he gets to shoot because the spike monster is in the is first in the order compared to him So that's good. That takes care of one two problems Love it when that happens um, You're gonna do one I Think I can live with one. Oh, no, so I was I was considering shooting here to push him here, but then he'll just hit the thing um uh, the other thing, which isn't good. Let's see. Okay. So we got to deal with him. we got to deal with him. How do we deal with you? Maybe we could... Do you have the extra range yet? You do. Oh, but that just, it just kills you no matter what. And 
I kind of need you to deal with this. Oof. You're tricky, sir. You're tricky. Maybe we have to do something different with Swap Mac. Oh, okay. Check it. <laughs> Check it. So, um, Swap Mac swaps here. And, you know, this will just shoot out there. Uh, flame artillery does this. Oh, problem. Then this guy hits swap mech. He's got two. He's got health. Okay. Which also which takes care of this, and this, and this, and then he can come deal with this. Okay. Yeah. It's not great. We are gonna take some damage. Got both of those robots dealt with. Plus, he's going to take this thing out. So that's good. Yeah, okay. That's an acceptable uh, thing. And we've got to go... Well, do we have to go? We could actually do this. Which makes him hit the mountain. And he'll start taking fire damage. Oh, he's not going to get taken out because of the, the regen. Okay, it's okay. We're doing all right. Bonk. Okay. So this is great. We've got three guys uh, trying to deal with Swap Mech, and Swap Mech just leaves. <laughs> so cool. Um... Four guys! Oh my gosh, four guys just wasting their turns. Sweet. So, what I will do, I think, is go here with Swap Mac and do this. And then, yeah, we're just gonna enjoy that fiasco. Uh, let's see. We'll have you put that on the fire. And we really need to get rid of this thing, because it keeps fixing them and making our fire slightly irrelevant. This is a great turn. Thank you, game, for just planning them up in a, a big line of bad decisions. Okay. Okay, so... He doesn't really matter. Well, he's going to die from fire, so he definitely doesn't matter. Um, we can swap him into the water, which is probably good. Got to push him somewhere. We push him into the water. Yeah. So we're, we're, yeah, we're in great shape. Zoom. Bye-bye. Swim, swim. Uh, and then we'll just do... I don't need to secure the pot, it's the last turn. You'll just get it, and then he'll die from fire. Excellent! Alright, no back life signs detected. Defend both robot factories, protect the lab, protect the sign pod. What's in the pod? What's in the pod? What's in the box? Reactor core. Okay, so I've got two cores. I want to give one here. So now he is max range. He can go up to four, which is fantastic. He can get basically anywhere on the field, swap people all around. He's his most powerful self. We got one left. It's really nice to have him have extra health. Um, the only other thing I might do with one right now is give this guy backburn. He basically drops the fire behind him uh, in the direction of of the way he's shooting. A lot like the um, the artillery in RST Max or the Rusting Hulks um, put the smoke behind him. But I, I really think it's it's good to give him some health because health is important. All right, we did great there. Less than, three, less than three grid damage, emergency batteries, freeze and defend both robots. Let's keep going for the big bonuses. 
So freeze and defend both robots. I don't know if we've done this one on the channel yet, but this little guy here will shoot ice and encase a thing in ice. And we need to do that to these two. Yeah, they are hostile. Um, so they will try to hurt us. And they only have one health. Luckily, we're, we're fairly low kill when we want to be. Okay, okay. Okay. So, easy way. Let's see. We can easily ice him. He can come down here and um, push. No, Dave, no. Yeah, no, he can't do it because he, he's got a... So we'll do it with swap. Okay, yeah. So we'll do like this. We'll do that. Because we're immune to fire, so we don't care. He's on fire and blocking the spawn. Ice this. Swap this to here so it doesn't hurt anything. And we'll just... We'll set this on... Oh! Sorry, swap back. We'll set this on fire. Oh, that was terrible. Should I reset? I should reset. That was terrible. Okay. <laughs> Freeze. Push. Okay, yeah, we can't do that one. And we can't really do this one either. All right, I was just going to set one of the holes on fire. But they both have a thing next to them that I don't want to be pushed upward. Um, yeah. So he will just... Make this forest on fire. Do -do -do. Okay. So it's like we hope. I think does he move at least three? Yes. So he can now get him as soon as he gets out of the way. Uh, we gotta save this. And we need to stop this from hitting this um, so that it, it doesn't break this back out of the ice. So let's see. What's your situation? If I hit you with him, you'll take two and then you'll die from fire before you attack. You come down here and you'll push this down. You... Actually, no, let's go there. Swap him into water. And then, freezy pop. And you just don't do anything of interest. Okay. So, the robots are now frozen. We just have to keep them from getting unfrozen. Okay. And we can still use this guy to freeze stuff. That's, that's really cool. So, it was like, boom, this problem's taken care of. Uh, let's see. Do, 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 do. Where are you shooting? You're shooting one, two, three squares up. So why don't we do this with you? Now we can set this wall on fire, except it would push him back, so I'm not going to do that. Uh, I might not do anything with him. We'll do this so that you definitely die, and you'll die from blocking the spawn. Hoorah. If I set him on fire, he would die before blocking the spawn. Okay. So I think this will be the last turn. Yeah. So, cool. So here, let's do this. Swap there. Set you on fire. Boom! All right, very good. Do, 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 do. All right, got some stars. He got promoted with plus two mecha HP, so now he has six. Um, I'm gonna take this out. Four is is generally enough, um, and give him plus one move, so he's even more mobile. Okay, defend the robots. Now, these are the ones that lay the little ice mines. So 
so they're on our side. Yep, yep. There we go. Okay. So let's see. Uh, fairly simple situation there. Um, we could just use him in this spot to burn this, burn this, and push it down. Um, swap. See, the problem with this guy is he's shooting in this direction, and in any of these squares, he is uh, causing trouble with buildings. Except for this one, but this guy's going to be here. Um, could we get to there? Nope, there's this building here. Oh, man. So we, we have got to set it up so that he is either... He loses his attack, or dies, or... We could do dies. No, we couldn't do dies, because he needs to do this. And we can do something else with him. Let's see. Who's first? He's first. If we set him on fire, then his one damage... No, the... this thing. Okay. Let's see. What if we do this? Set... Oh, get out of there. So, we'll move Swap Mac. We'll set him on fire and push him down. Use... I mean, the worst case scenario, we just do this and stand in front of him and just, like, take a damage, which is fine. There's no... Yeah, let's do that. Okay. We'll just set him on fire, push him on the thing. Yeah, love it. Uh, okay. Let's see. We'll do... Oh. <laughs> okay, so he's going to be there. Where is there any place we would like to swap him to? <gasps> Here. Oh, yeah, then we don't take the damage. Now you're thinking with portals. We are going to get shot. <laughs> no, well, mm. let's see. He'll take a fire, but then, then the regenerate happens. You can see it comes after the fire. Yeah, so we're going to take... One. Whatever. That's why we liked Tim that extra month. That's the regenerate sound, by the way. Okay. Alright. We're managing. Okay, so... We've got a fun little game we could play <laughs> where we swap with this. Or swap with this. Honestly, yeah, let's do that. There. Now, none of... All of these problems are taking care of each other. Um, dude. Takes out the... Uh, that other issue. The regenerating thing. Set this on fire so whatever comes out is pre-burning. Okay. 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 And good. So, pre-burning. Stepped on the ice. Try and break him out of the ice. Uh, let's see. He's going to try to shoot that one. Which we can easily take care of. Um, we could... Let's do this. And give him fire. And set that on fire. Oh, and it blocks that. Ha ha ha. All right, last turn. So we're going to have him plus two other guys. Oh, and they're all on fire. Okay, so none of this matters, right? Because he just leaves. Bye. And... Did that. And celebratory. Let's do this. Take some damage. Excellent. Alright, mission complete. Do do do. Alright. 
So, we're taking our pick of one of these three. So, less than three good damage, protect the batteries. And it's got Ice Storm. Uh, less than four mech damage, protect the power generator. Less than three good damage, protect the coal plants. Let's do this one. I like the Ice Storm, it's fun. Alright. Okay, so these squares here, I don't know if we've seen this, but these squares here, uh, at the start of the turn, um, anything on them, mountains, buildings, robots, monsters, will get encased in ice. Um, and so we can use that to our advantage by pushing monsters into it. We can use it as a defensive advantage, like if something was going to shoot us, we could um, push it you know, into the ice. Or we could be in the ice and then have that sort of ice shield. Uh, I'm going to make a real simple move here and just get him in there. Um, and then I think I'll go here. So that he's not in the ice, so we have use of him. You are going to cause a problem, so let's... You're going to cause a problem. You're going to cause a big problem. You're going to shoot a building. Even if I push you over there. If I push you down, you're going to hit the batteries, which I need to protect. Should have thought about this first. But I honestly don't... I mean, I guess there's nothing terrible about him being in the ice. Okay, reset turn. I hate using reset turn on the first turn. Um... So what we need is to push him up or to over here, which means we need to drop the bomb here or here. And I don't, we can't do either of those. Okay, yeah, we're just gonna have to take damage. Okay, so what we will do though is go there and put him on fire so that we block a spawn and he takes a damage even if we lose this building 19 grid defense Ooh. I'm not super enthusiastic there's those ices and nope okay that's okay health is a resource okay so he's gonna get iced he's just there okay so we could easily swap him to this guy to this position um, so he's just shooting nothing you are on fire and that's a that's that's fine do this for some reason oh he is gonna take another damage from um, Oh, shoot, the grid damage requirement. I forgot. All right, we gotta be careful. Okay, three guys, three of us. He's gonna get iced. Um, so this is that situation I was talking about where if I was to say, stay here, I would get iced, and then um, his shot would just break me out of the ice. So like, I do this, take care of him, Aha. Uh -huh. Um, but wait, there's more. I could, well, no, I want him to break me out of the ice. Unless I do this. I don't mind. Okay, yeah. Oh, but then that does that. <laughs> we'll just... We'll do this. There, he'll get iced and then stop the spawn and break out of the ice, so we'll only have two to deal with. Okay, so this is fine. Um, we don't even have to... Here, nope, 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 all the way, all the way, all the way. Zoom! Quantum entanglement. Teleport unit. Of, teleport a unit four tiles away. We did it. Okay, and then just because we can. Mm. Storms got me. It's 
So we did take the one. Okay, corporate HQ. Destroy the scorpion leader. So he's going to do webbing, I think. If I remember right, he webs all four tiles around him and hits all of them. So that'll be cool. Uh, let's see, let's start you here, here, here. Luckily, swap mech kind of can solve lots and lots of problems. All right, so we want him, we need to make him uh, not alive. So I'm thinking, let's see. We push him down to this corner. All he does is um, hit mountains. Or we set him on fire first, and then you... Yeah. Okay. And then, what is the attack order? You are first. We'll do... Where do I want to put you? Up? Or down here? You hit a mountain. Okay, so that's three off of him. Oh, nice! The bump. I forgot he pushes, too. Okay. So you're in you're in rough shape, my friend. Let's see. So this matters. All the rest of the... Uh, this, I mean, this type matters, yes. Um, let's see. What if we... How much are you going to do? One? It's fine. Um, if we do our two damage and push him down here... Yeah. Uh, I'm liking that. Okay. We might have a, an issue here for what I'm, for what I'm thinking. And I'm, I'm okay with it. We'll push you here. Swap here. So he's going to take a fire and block a spawn, and that'll finish him. Um, and then we could do this to get rid of that. He still might hit this. Mm -hmm. Okay, got rid of the boss. Okay, so let's see. You, oh wow, you got a lot, but you're only you're only dealing with him. Um, he's first. I was gonna say I could just swap with him, and they'll wail on him, but he might hit this, uh, which is not ideal. So we'll play it a little safer and less daring. So what I was thinking was, yeah, it's fine, I can take one more damage. Oh no, that's going to hit that building, we don't want to do that, okay. New plan, new plan, new plan. We push, oh, I hate these things. I've only got two health. Oh, we can do this, actually. And then we just, and then they just don't hit anything. We could even put him on fire so that he's on fire. Because being on fire is how we like things. Alright. This should be last turn, I think. A lot of dudes. Okay. He's gonna die from fire. He's almost gonna die from fire. Um, we could give him a bump to make him give him the one damage that he needs uh, let's see he's Ooh, this could be cool yeah this so now he shoots him and he'll hit this rock Do this 
So now he's going to die from fire. And we'll just move out of the way. Yep, no buildings were hurt in the making of this turn. Kaboom! Get that rock. Alright, we did it! Pinnacle Island complete! Let's see where we're at. We only took one damage from that, so that's not too bad. You've saved Pinnacle, accomplishing every objective without fail. Allow me to provide additional aid. So let's see. Um, this doesn't generally float my boat because it's a one-off. Um, she's pretty cool. She just gets a f one little move after doing her attack. Um, and a couple extra grid power, but we're doing all right. I'm probably going to end up buying some. So yeah, let's take her. She's not in our hangar anyway. Uh, let's see. Who, where would she be good? Two, three, she, she slots right into this with the re HP replacement. And him, the swap mech being able to, uh, just kind of juke out of the way once it's done its thing. Primo. Um, so, yeah, let's do that. Okay, spend your reputation. Thank you, Ganymede, you have been helpful. Uh, I hope they don't scrap you for parts. Okay, so this, let's see, this jumps over and does a smoke. Brute, we don't have a brute. Kickoff boosters, max gain, plus one move if they start to turn into each other. Or an acid shooter. Applies acid and pushes. Not terrible. But we might just consider, you know, maxing up, ranking up our stuff as much as we can. Uh, so we'll put one into defense. And buy three cores. So let's see. We could give him even more range. We could add some damage to him, which kind of seems good. We Damage is the thing, like direct damage. We have none, unless something is already on fire. So I'm actually thinking we do that. Okay. Very cool. That's uh, just a hair over 30 minutes, so we are going to stop there. And again, please comment uh, with any of those games you'd like to see me try. This is probably going to be three more episodes, um, so you got some time. And uh, just let me know what you like. Again, the possibilities, I'll, put, I'll have Terry put them down in the uh, description too. Um, the possibilities are FTL, Dungeon Top, For the King, Dicey Dungeons, and Steam World Quest. Um, I think that is a subtitle of hand of Gilgamech. Um, anyway, let me know what you think. And until next time, take care, everybody.